Hello, Dad here. I was just thinking, uh, like I said last time, I'm, I'm trying to be a little more uh, regular with posting this for the family, and since I'm I'm gone so much with work, and also for the grandkids, and who knows future great great grandkids. But a real quick thought for this week. Is, is it possible to do too much good or too much of a good thing? That's probably the better question. Is it possible to do too much of a good thing? And I would say yes. And the, the reason being, and I'm not talking about being kind, being charitable, loving people, things like that. I'm, I'm talking about just doing good things. Uh, work can be a good thing. Can that be overdone? Exercise is a good thing. Can that be overdone? And I'm going to use the example of, of just exercise because it, when it was kind of, uh, the end result surprised me. Wednesday, I was doing some uh, wind sprints. And I haven't done wind sprints in quite a while. I, it was early in the morning. I felt good. You know, I started off doing some shorter ones, and I, I would lengthen them out. And eventually, after about 20 minutes or so into this, and it wasn't nonstop, I, there, was, there was some rest periods, but I started to feel in my, the back of my right leg was just starting to get a little bit tight. I thought, well, okay, we're not doing too bad. I'm just going to do a few more. And uh, I kept going, no problem, felt good. And really, I, I did, I felt good, I felt fine. And I thought, okay, there was no harm, no foul. Even though there was that warning sign of overdoing it. <laughs> so later on that day, uh, I was at a, a parking lot, a parking area. And somebody uh, that I knew pulled their truck up and wanted to ask me a question. So I started hopping over there, not hopping, but trotting over there to the truck. About three steps into this, my, my right leg just stopped. It, it froze up, it quit working. And I went, boom, I, I rolled. You know, I, I just, I, I rolled. It was a, uh, it could have been a face plant, but for better or for worse, I've had other other training in the past that allowed me to to just do a, a roll out of it, and it was more embarrassing than anything. Tore up my my jeans and teeny tiny scuff marks on my body, but <laughs> it's something I never would have expected, as I felt so good. So I think the lesson from this. Is when you start getting the warning signs of whether it's work, uh, you get to the point where, man, you know, you just have a hard time concentrating, but you, you just want to get this one last thing done. Or you're, you're working on the farm or something and you're just so tired, but you'd want to get this one last thing done. If there's something that's not just, man, you know, I'm, I don't feel like doing anymore, but a warning sign, physical, mental, emotional, pay attention to those warning signs and take a break, relax, and let things heal. Sometimes the recovery takes longer. We'll get to the point where we'll, we'll, do something and will will break again physically mentally emotionally spiritually we can we can break we freeze up and we just stop doing and would it have been better to take a little bit of a rest earlier so you could keep going instead of constantly uh, I guess some people have a hard time saying no. They'll, 
people will, will see that, oh yeah, if I ask so-and-so to do something, we know that they're going to do it because they care, they want to see things happen, they want to do good things in the world, whether it's, you know, for work or for their their friends or for a religious organization or a fraternal organization or something like that, but you have to be careful of burnout. And it's not that the organization, whatever it is, is bad or faulty or wrong, but well-meaning people maybe weren't aware of what toll it might be taking on the other person. So that's just my quick thought for the day. You know, do good things. Enjoy yourself. Have fun. Give of yourself. Share. Uh, exercise. Eat right. All those good things. But... Remember to pay attention to the warning signs so you just don't stop and fall flat on your face. Alrighty? Alright, uh, again, I'm going to try to be more regular about this. Love you guys. Have fun. Bye-bye.